I'd say Gopterix stands 15 feet tall. It is, in fact, a pterosaur, a reptile with wings that here, as it stalks through the trees, it has to keep tightly folded. This forest, so rich in small creatures, is one of its regular hunting grounds. This is the heaviest animal ever to fly, and there is nowhere else here where it can open its gigantic wings, which are over 30 feet across. But for Hatsakopteryx, the beach is a launching pad. His wings will carry him to yet another forest where life proliferates more variously and more abundantly than anywhere else on our prehistoric planet. Segopteryx, giant predatory pterosaurs of the taller trees. Hatsegopteryx are very intelligent pterosaurs. Now that the element of surprise has gone, they change tactics. Spreading out across the clearing, they try to flush out any prey that might still be there. Island hopping pterosaurs move on to try their luck elsewhere. But they may nonetheless get visitors. Hatsegopteryx. This male has arrived carrying a 40-pound Tethyshadros carcass, a prize from a recent hunt. He is 15 feet tall with a wingspan of over 30 feet. Hatsikopteryx are Europe's top predators. But this male has come here to reveal another side to his character.
he has constructed a display to make it clear to any females passing overhead that he is looking for a mate. And last, a female. She seems interested, but a little more persuasion might be necessary. And he needs to be careful. One well-aimed peck from her beak could quickly bring his whole mating season to an end. His display must demonstrate that he has the good genes that her young would do well to inherit. The dead dinosaur suggests that he's a good hunter, and carrying it here has proved that he's a strong flyer. But if she is impressed, she isn't showing it. Yet. Time to produce some new evidence of his eligibility. Head lifts invite her to come closer. Now she gives him a little encouragement. A synchronized dance creates trust between them. Another male. He's much younger, but he could still be a rival. That's him dealt with. She's back. Seeing off a potential rival might even be another point in his favor. He continues from where he left off. One last reminder of his strength. And this is his only contribution to fatherhood. It's all over in just a few seconds. But it's the start of the next generation of these giant flying hunters. Islands like this may only be small, but like countless others around the world, they bear witness to crucial moments in the lives of some of the most unusual creatures 
on the prehistoric planet 